Hello, Stuart from Upcycle TV, and I'm going to show you how you can paint a PVC U door. It's a water based paint, so there's no harsh chemicals, anything like that. It's very easy. I'm going to show you now two coats, and we'll be done. Nothing over the top, no major preparation. So let's get cracking. Wash it down first. going to mix in some sugar soap. I always use the powdered form, uh, mix it with water. I find that, I don't know, I just, I just think it's better than the ready mix stuff. You can apply the sugar soap with a brush, just lash it on. You're not trying to clean it at this point. You're literally just getting it on. Make sure you cover every area that's being painted. I'm not gonna paint the frame, the base or anything. I'm literally just gonna paint the door because it's coming out anyway. We're putting a window in here. Um, I just thought it'd make a, you know, it's a good opportunity to show you how you can do it on a video, but you'll be able to see enough from this, how it works. Say principle on windows, patio doors, anything like that. Is PVCU, paint it, gutter in. We painted some fascia board around the dental clinic that was ply board, um, and it's been up two years and it's in perfect condition still. So there's, there's loads of uses for this. Right, next up, I'm gonna give it a little light key. You don't have to go crazy with this. You don't have to start sanding it away. Just giving it a very light key, just to help the paint stick. Again, also just a bit of a clean as well, any, still any little bits on the surface. So I'm gonna use this as a, a very fine sanding sponge. You can use a fine sandpaper, anything like that really um, will do the job. So the very last thing I'm gonna do for the prep is drink this, no, not really. So. Last bit of prep, I'm just gonna go over with methylated spirits. I'm gonna do that with a cloth. It's just gonna take away all the little bits that have been left from the sanding um, sponge and also uh, little bits of white plastic. It's really good for the sort of static um, methylated spirits, just to last final clean down. Smells like my dad. Only joking, dad. <laughs> Doesn't really. Okay, folks, this is the product we're gonna use. So it's French Eek and the range is al fresco, which not surprisingly means that you can use it outside. I've painted all sorts of things you could possibly imagine with this paint, it's incredible. It's water-based, smells lovely. Goes on like a dream, like you'll see. I've gone for a colour called Old Blue Eyes, um, just because we had it left over from a project. So, um, as I said before, the door's not staying, so um, it was ideal. You can buy the paint online from frenchiquepaint.co.uk or you can go to one of their many stockists. Um, they tend to be small independent stores, usually that sell painted furniture. Uh, if you put into the website, find a stockist near you and put your postcode in, then hopefully um, you'll find one near you. But as I say, if not, just go onto their website and you can order it directly there. So here we go, let's put some on. I'm gonna start here just so you can see. There's, there are different products like this on the market. I've not used any of them, so I can't say which one is the best or anything like that, but I, I just know that Frenchy Cal Fresco works really well.
as you can see the first coat's done now so i'm just going to let that dry it's a nice warm sunny day so should be ready to go again in about half an hour something like that okay here we are all finished so i've given it a couple of coats it's taken me about an hour and a half if that it's a little bit rushed because as i said before i'm not keeping the door so i just wanted to get it done quick and you know as quick as possible and yeah but i'm really happy with the result um maybe it's hard to take out now i think it's lovely the color's old blue eyes we actually use this to paint my mum and dad's um, front door and windows this color is great and they've had it up for a good couple of years they use a pressure washer to clean it and everything so it's really hardy there's a six-year guarantee on it there's loads of colors to choose from you've got yellows and pinks black red green all sorts of wonderful colors have a look on the french Eek website look through our videos here on youtube because you'll find that we've painted all sorts in this paint it's absolutely fantastic very versatile love painting kitchens with it because it's washable so um, for obvious reasons that's great for kitchens and there's a brilliant one on there that we painted in sage green so have a look and check that out that's it for me for today i hope that video's helped if you've got any questions please do pop it in the comments and if you do get around to doing something like this yourself please show me some pictures um, i'd love to see i'm really interested in it i'm stuart and this is upcycle tv <laughs>